The president made it clear that this was to avert the humanitarian crisis that they were taking these actions and to protect American military personnel that are in Erbil and in Baghdad. That's not a strategy. That, that's not a policy. That, that is simply uh, a very narrow and focused approach to a, uh, a problem which is metastasizing as we speak. Candy, there was a guy a month ago that was in Syria, went back to the United States, came back and blew himself up. We're tracking a hundred Americans who are over there now fighting for ISIS. ISIS is attracting extreme elements from all over the world, much less, less the Arab world. So and what, what do have you we done? suggest, Senator? Said I would be rushing equipment to Erbil. I would be launching airstrikes not only in Iraq but in Syria against ISIS. They have erased the boundaries between Iraq and Syria. I would be uh, providing as much training and equipment as I can uh, to, as I said, to the Kurds. And I would do a lot of things that we can uh, not have to wait for Maliki to leave. There, an, uh, and I would be uh, giving assistance to the Syrian Free Syrian Army, which is on the ropes right now because we failed to help them. And this all goes back to a number of steps the president took, including a failure to leave a residual force in Iraq.